Welcome back lads and lasses, Yuldef Lucario here, and welcome back to some Pokemon Tournament DX content, and today we're going to be playing Empoleon. Now, I know with the other characters, this has been my first impressions of them, like the very first time I've seen their moves and such, but Empoleon we got a taster in the demo, so this is not my first time playing Empoleon. But it actually feels good that I can play Empoleon on my own controls, rather than the standard DX demo controls. But anyway, we're just going to run through the action dojo of Empoleon's actions. We're going to go into uh, the combo dojo, learn Empoleon's basic combos. Then I'm going to play some matches against the CPU. And then I'm going to lab Empoleon for a few hours and see if I can take him online. Right, but keep in mind, remember, my controls are back to front. Just so if you're watching this, you don't get confused. I uh, light attack with A, I poke my move with Y, I jump with X, I hit homing slash strong attack with B, I block with L, and I support Pokemon with R. For you guys, most of that will be there with that. So we'll just get into it. First we got the um, neutral Y in field. Most characters have a move like this anyway, just a little projectile. And Polygon does just go quite fast though. What's its range like? Hold on, let me just uh, put Lucario over here. Do this Naruto run to get away. I wonder who does it better, Lucario or Polygon. Okay, it goes about half the length of the stage. That's quite useful. Okay, so we got the link up, which is uh, into Aqua Jet. And the side version. It's like little tidal waves, that's really cool. But of course, we can link that up again into a f different move that's not Aqua Jet. We're just throwing a project. Oh, okay. Oh, that's that. That's the forward Y in field. I thought it was Aqua Jet. No, that's um, neutral A. Okay. And you got an anti air for field, that is really nice that Empoleon has that. So don't jump on me, sucker. It's like um, it's like Pikachu um Pikachu's. What is it? What is it? Pikachu's Electro Ball. And now we got midair. The water sprouts, so I imagine that yeah, it juggles, and I imagine it stays there for a while. How long does it stay there? About a second or two. That's nice. So now we got the homing attack. Four hits, three button presses. Not too bad. Back X says spin to win. Now I might as well, yeah, here's the thing about Empoleon. Empoleon has one of the slowest walk speeds in the game. He doesn't actually look too slow here, but you'll see in dual phase, he is pretty slow. But you can, uh, there's a couple of moves that Empoleon can use to slide around on ice. One of them is Ice Beam. That's not Ice Beam. Ice Beam, there's uh, the GX, and of course there's um, the back X in field. There's actually a really nice video about explaining all the mechanics of Empoleon's slide by Mitchell that I will leave in the description. If you guys really are interested in playing Empoleon, I'd recommend checking that out. So we've got the dive down, and of course we can slide on ice. And if the game didn't force me to stop, I could have got a homing attack. But yeah, w slowest walk speed in the game. I mean, look at this. That's slower than the champ. That is hideous. But of course, look at this hop. Look at this hop. Oh, it's so nice. I like that. So now we got dual phase, so we got the 5Y. Standard Pokey combo. And of course, when you follow up with Aqua Jet, you've got quite a lot of things you can do. If you just mash Y, you'll do this move. If you mash Strong Attack, you'll do the Waterfall. And if you mash Pokemon Move, you'll do a Rock Smash. And that'll give a defense drop. You'll have to figure out which one's the best. So we've got the Forward. And again, it goes into Aqua Jet. And as you can imagine, there's different mix-ups. There's just mashing Y. There's a uh, going into waterfall. That's not waterfall. Why can't I? Do I just fuck up? That? Do I just suck in life that badly? Okay, it's not letting me. The game isn't letting me. Okay, so we got the high stance eight uh, Y. Does that anti-air again, good for catching the opponent on a jump, and it's got good range up close as you can see it still hits the opponent. And maybe shorter opponents like Weavile or Pikachu can duck under it. So we've got the 
Two Y. I'm not sure if that leads into anything. Yeah, it does. Aqua Jet again. Into Waterfall. I don't know where my Rock Smash went. I got this move again. This move is very good for like movement. Like you see, Empoleon moves a good distance off the JY. Look at that. That distance is further than his walk will ever take him. And these projectiles are good for keeping the opponent back. Okay, so now we got neutral. We got 5x, which is cut. I don't think that's actually cut, but you know it can lead into the 5y mashing. And I'm pretty sure you can confirm that out of a counter. Yeah, and that can lead into a combo. So that's really your combo starter. This is like Lucario's 5x, it's not really good to do it on block. But since you can get it out of a counter, that's going to be a good way to get a combo starter. We've got the back x, which is a good... Which is the 4x, which is a good juggling move, because you notice you can do that, and then... Do combos like that. I don't know other ones. Uh, but we'll find out. We've got the um, 8x, which I don't know if it's safe on block. It might be. But it doesn't have any juggle. It's just a good get off me too. And now we've got the 2x. And again, it's this move, but we can slide around. Yep. I might explain some of the mechanics if you guys don't want to watch Mitchell's video, but I'd recommend watching it. He goes over and things in far more detail than I do. Okay, so we got the GX, which again we can slide on. Grab, just standard, we all know how to grab. Grabbing is bad. Then we've got the counter. It's a low, so the opponent can jump over it. It's always good to know that. So now we've got the special moves. We've got Aqua Jet. And Aqua Jet, we can just mash the button to get Rock Smash. If we press our X, we get Surf. If we press Jump, which is B, we get um, Waterfall, and if we press uh, Y, we get Cut, which is nice. We got Ice Beam, and again, we can slide on Ice Beam, way to close in. And if you actually press uh, Y during Ice Beam, you'll fire some projectiles, you can go into a homing attack. That was a homing attack, but it was just a faster belly slide. We can go into Hydro Cannon, which also hits behind you, so you can, that can work. You can also angle Ice Beam to fire in a different direction, slide in that direction, and all the mechanics supply there. So we've got Defog, which is uh, the, two, the back Y in field. Defog does eliminate some projectiles. It, I don't know which ones they eliminate. There's probably a list somewhere. Maybe I should find that. We've got the JA, which is a steel wing. This move, from what I've heard, has a weird hitbox. Like, it doesn't hit all the time. Let's just smack them up with it. And then we've got Drill Pick, which is the 8A in Jewel. Pretty sure that's a good get off me tool. Yeah. During Aqua Jet Press. And then we can go up. Waterfall, Rock Smash, I already explained some of this, boom. Surf. And we can slide, yeah, yeah, we do. So just some basics of Empoleon, slide attack, so we can throw that out, and we can throw a little projectile, or we can just slide on the belly. Get a hard knockdown. And during slide, we can j that's not jump. That ain't jump. The interesting thing to note about um, slide for, like, the back X. Oh, that was Hydro Cannon. Like, the interesting thing to note about slide for the 2X is if you slide forward. No, if you slide backwards, because you can do that by inputting backwards, and you jump, you will always jump forward. Always. That's the 
For Ice Beam, I don't think that applies. Because you can only slide forward. So you always jump forward. So during slide, yep, we know this. It can lead to a 5Y combo. Or it can lead to cut, which can lead to other combos. And during slide, we can jump. We can only jump forward. And again, we can Hydro Cannon, which hits behind us. If the opponent jumps behind us, that's useful too. And now we've got this energy move, Deep Blue Monarch. We've seen this before. It's a grab, so your opponent can't block it, but they can jump over it. And I'm pretty sure it can. Con you can confirm it with um, Aqua Jet. I don't really know how to do that confirm yet. Maybe I'll look into that later. Alright, so that's us done with the Action Dojo. We're now going to move on to the Combo Dojo and learn Empoleon's basic combos. Okay, here we are in the Combo Dojo. So we'll go through all of Empoleon's basic combos. I will... Go through each of these in detail. I'm not going to click all combo run through and just do them which ones. I'm going to go through each one, see if they're off the wall or if I can find anything better. Okay, so we got a JY combo. So that looks pretty simple. Yep. There's probably more damaging things we can get off JY. An interesting thing to note about Empoleon, similar to Krugunk, which I didn't like about Krugunk, is Empoleon's GX goes straight down. Rather than um, diagonally like someone like Lucario's or Pika Libre's or Shadow Mewtwo's. Which I'm not used to them going straight down. Really only Gardevoir is the only character I've played that does that. And Chandelure. But meh. But the thing about Empoleon is we can actually slide with the uh, GX. And we can also slide backwards. And jump around. And go for Hydro Cannon mix-ups. Like slow. But anyway, this one's a GY combo. So maybe I might use the JY more than the um fucked up. Maybe I might use the JY more than the GX. So I'll see what better JY combos. Because I always think you need to have a JY combo. Like Lucario, his JY combo is different from his GX combo. With JY you can fall up into a 5X. With the GX, 5X is not confirmed, so I go for 5Y instead. In Polyon, I'll do something similar. I'll find a combo for both GX and JY. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. This is a slide. That's... The game doesn't even need to teach you that. Pretty much anyone who mashes buttons will learn that. That one's pretty simple. But again, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Like, when you go for Ice Beam Slide, yeah, you can go straight into 5Y, so I'll again have to lab to see which one's better. So we've got Cut into Defog, Cancel into Surf. But again, there's probably something better you can get off of that. But I didn't actually know you could Defog, Cancel into Surf. I didn't actually know that. One thing about Surf I'm going to mention right now. Um, how do you do it? Oh yeah. Like, you can actually jump off of Surf. I'm not doing it right. Okay, I'm not doing this right. I'm pressing the wrong button. Okay, I don't know how to jump off stuff. I thought you'd press shield and cancel it. Wait, I'm not pressing shield, that's why. Okay, I don't know. I know there are... Uh, I know some people who have probably watched this channel who are maining Empoleon, so they'll probably keep me right. Apri, help. Apri, please. <laughs> okay, so let's get into the next one. This is a wall combo, so... 8x um, wall splats. I know there is actually a combo video by Swallow and Bimmy Question, which I will also link in the description. That has much better combos than this wall. I'll probably watch that video to learn my Empoleon combos. They just made one for Scissor as well, and they've got one for Decidueye. They'll have one for Krogunk and Darkrai incoming. So I recommend checking out Swallow and Bim as well. I'll leave them in the description too. So. That one's easy, since you just hold up for the majority of that combo. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, you can just hold up and mash, mash X, Y, A, then X again. That's basically what you do. That one's pretty simple, but there's probably better ones. Okay, let's see what this is. Okay. I think the slide mechanic is going to take some getting used to. Okay, I didn't press the button right. 
I'm not pressing this right. And now, um, I was trying to mash a uh, 2x so much, I accidentally let like, go. Oh. oh, come on, really? Oh, I'm too, I was too slow. Let me just uh, double check this. Wow, you have to cancel that um, slide quickly. This one might take some getting used to. Oh, come on. I'm struggling with this one. I think the problem is, uh, the 4x has so much end lag that I'm trying to mash 2x into it and it's not working. Uh, I had it there. I had it there, but I pressed, um, 5y too much. Got it there. But again, the fact that, um, 4x does not look safe on block whatsoever means that you probably won't go for this one unless you can combo start it. That slide it around. Uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. I know what it is. I know what I'm looking for. Oh god. Yeah, you can only really confirm this one out of a counter attack. So let's try that again. I forgot. I didn't input slide to you. Fuck it. I don't like that one. Okay, this will teach us surf cancelling. This will teach us surf cancelling into steel wing. Okay, so let's see. Oh, that's wrong button. Now I'm pressing. Pressing wrong buttons. Is it, uh, yeah, it's steel wing. But I'm not sure how to surf cancel. Just press shield? Do you just press shield? Oh, I had it there, but I cancelled Surf too early. Now, when do you cancel Surf? But you cancel Surf right away. I didn't do it too early, actually. But I'm, I'm pressing, uh, JY. And then you have to go straight into Defog. Doesn't work for you. What? Defog didn't actually confirm there. Defog didn't actually confirm there for me. Come on, really? I'm struggling with this one. I can't get that surf cancelled down. And of course, I'm not fast enough to do this one, so I'm just going to leave it. I'm not going to try and do a combo for like five minutes that I'm going to struggle with. One more try. Oh, I had it there. Okay, since I almost had it there, I'll try again. Damn it. Oh, I defog is so slow. I'm not getting the right wall properties. Again, there's probably simpler wall combos that you can pull off. Like, there was that one a while back that... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I just want to watch this again. I just want to see the damage. So that went... That done about 180 damage. What was that wall combo one? This one. 180 versus... That does practically the same damage and it's a much easier combo. Then again, 2x on block might not be safe. There's no point going for a move if it's not safe and you're going to get punished for it. So that's the thing. So now we'll just dive into some matches against the CPU, see what we can take, what we can learn. And we'll just have some games. I'll probably lose because, you know, my first time facing a CPU, so I'm going to suck. Alright, we got the first battle. A bird versus a bird. You notice we have all three of the bird starters in this game. We've got Blaziken and Polyon and Decidueye. And they're Firewater Grass types. Cool. I don't know what support to go for, but I'm going to try Eevee since I've seen other Empoleons use her. Eevee, so... Okay, that didn't work. I should not have slid there. Just have to get used to... Oh, come on! Oh my god, here we go again. Now, I know the problem with the AI grabbing. The fact is, the AI can react to things that no normal human can. 
No normal human could react to me going for a, uh, like, counter like that. Sorry, I can throw up this. Yeah, I'm mashing. Oh, look at that! I just decided to try that. So, cut into 8Y. That can work. I'll take a grab. Maybe. Oh, God, did I... Jump? Nope. Oh my lord, the AI is just mashing buttons. The AI is literally mashing buttons! And I don't know how to get out of the corner with Empoleon. God, Empoleon looked pissed off there. I don't know how to get out of the corner with Empoleon. Ah, uh, that ran right into that. Oh my lord. This is a problem. Wait, maybe you're better going for, um, Rock Smash on block. Okay. Oh, fuck. Like, this is a problem. Because I played uh, Empoleon on the demo, with the standard DS controls, I'm getting a little mixed up. Okay, break the block there. I wanted to slide there. Ah, I'm trying to go for, um, the 5X, but I'm actually pressing 5X instead of B. Oh, really? He jumped over me again? That is some bullshit. Yeah, I just 5 wide into burst there because I knew that would work. He would have had the block to not die to the 5Y, or he would have, but he would have got hit by the burst. I don't know if that if 5Y confirms into burst like that. I know that from my experience of watching and playing against Mewtwo and Gengar, whenever someone has a grab burst, everyone pretends the floor is lava. Oh, flippin' hell. Yeah, I should've just went straight into Rock Smash there. Got it that time. I like Waterfall, it's really cool. That was ridiculous. Boom. Stop going. Ah, oh, I tried to tech at the last second because I saw that coming. I'm actually protecting the AI. Boom. Grabbing his bad AI. And Hydro Cannon to wrap her up. So that's a win for... I don't know where to call him Happy Feet or Pingu. I think Happy Feet sounds better. I know some people are going to go crazy over Empoleon. I mean, from what I've heard, like, Pikachu is Empoleon's worst matchup. Like, Empoleon can't do anything if Pikachu just spams um, 5x, which I can sort of picture. I don't know. But from what I've heard about Empoleon, oh god, Empoleon does. Like, Empoleon is that character that can't put on pressure, but he can punish you hard if you mess up. Which means that he's not going to be good for my Shadow Mewtwo, since my Shadow Mewtwo is just terrible. But my Lucario might be able to handle him. I don't think I need a new character for Empoleon. I'll have to see. I don't know yet, I could be wrong. Okay, so defog into cut is not safe. Really? In situations, no human would do that. Well, most humans wouldn't do that. Ah, oh, he... Is he gonna slide? Yep. Oh. Sliding on him. And then you can follow that up into a waterfall if you don't feel phase shift. So I know basic Empoleon combos, nice. Oh, I didn't think he would actually go into Surf there. Gonna edit that sneeze out.
Oh, good. I don't think so. And I can pop Eevee. Now, how do you do this? Yes, that's me, um, confirm. Aqua Jet into Burst Attack. It's a definite confirm. I've had it used to me before. And with Eevee, this will easily kill. Even scaled. And because I'm also in Rage. But Aqua Jet, Empoleon has a Burst Confirm. And his, and his Burst is a grab, keep in mind. Poor Mewtwo, he's the only one with a grab that doesn't have that. Yeah, Rock Smash is a Counter Pierce. So if Rock Smash comes towards you, don't try and counter it. Oh, he Aqua Jetted right into that Rock Smash. That was too far away. I could have followed up there. The AI should not be dropping block like that. I'm getting used to the slide mechanic. Let me get my paws on you. Well, fins. Wings? Yeah, wings. That's better. <laughs> my lord. Oh. Surf lasts a long time. I could have countered that. Okay, so Aqua Jet is like Lucario's Bone Rush in a lot of ways. That's a punish option. And then you go into Rock Smash and it's safe, um, to do it safely. But I'm pretty sure Rock Smash can be punished on block. Like I'm just thinking Lucario, yeah, he could probably Bone Rush that. Uh, Surf, you can cancel it and jump out the way. Cut and Waterfall don't look safe at all, so we'll have one more. We found the Burst Confirm, that's really all I wanted. Okay, so we got Zard. This is like we're playing the demo again. Got Lizard on. So we'll see what we can do against Zard. Yeah, simply for, because of the slide mechanic, and Polyon's gonna take some getting used to. Okay, so last match. Ah, I wanted to do Ice Beam, but I done the wrong move. I went kind of too early. Oh, he went... That... Uh, Surf actually looks safe there. Because he had to punish by grab. Aw, his shield came back. I wanted to break it. Oh, oh lord, why? I'll punish that. On safe Flare Blitz. Boom. Oh, but yeah, it's mashing. I didn't... I countered that too early. Ah, I thought it would grab. Of course, the AI isn't going to do things that real Charizard means would do. Because that flamethrower there was not safe on block. I could have punished that with grab. That's why I didn't think he would go for it, but a real person wouldn't. But the AI sucks more than I do with Empoleon. Are you serious? Woo. Spend the win. So drill pick seems like a nice punish and I can follow up into a rock smash. Oh, I just low profiled under that fire punch. Pop Eevee. Slide right past him. Now yeah, cancel that slide. I wanted to cancel it. That Flare Blitz was not safe, so we'll punish it, Zard. I'm like Eevee. Froggy Deer might be good too. I could probably go Jirachi, but I don't want to really use Empoleon's Burst too much. I can't believe I didn't punish that. If I, I wish I had Eevee here. That's so why support focus it might be better. Oh, oh I'm counterattacking too early. With Lucario, I would just hold block. Got the 
burst exhaust, he could have helped block that. Oh my god, are you serious? Really? And I'll have Eevee to back me up. Oh, come on, really? Now I got to grab Baron the Fire Punch. Oh no, I think he's gone over this! With his homing, are you serious? Oh, I tried to counter! Oh, fuck me. I'm terrible with Empoleon. I can't believe that burst missed no because he went for a homing attack and charged his homing attack puts him in the air. That sucks. Ah, uh, why? And the AI is so annoying. The AI is so bad. Like, the AI can react to things that no normal human can react to. And they go to for things that I don't expect because they're not safe. The AI plays an optimal. Don't be the AI. Okay, so what I'll do is, is I will lab Empoleon and be right back later, um, tomorrow? Yeah, I'll be back tomorrow with, um, some Empoleon online plays. So, thank you guys very much for watching. I'm Joel Ficario. If you guys did enjoy this video, hit that like button and let me know with a comment too. It really helps. If you want to see more poking content and some online play of Empoleon, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell so you're notified when those go up. And if you want to check out my social media links and ask me up for a game, but also you can go to Discord. I'm on Discord, so if you can't get onto that, if you can't get onto, uh, what is it? Facebook or Twitter and you're in the Poké Discord, just hit me up with at, at Joel Ficario. You should know that by now. So thank you guys very much for watching. I'm Joel Ficario. Hope you all.